Hey Rex, I'm Kylie and you're watching SVTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. The Writing Center is looking for new consultants. If you're interested, fill out the virtual application by May 1st. Contact Ms. Sands if you have any questions. Seniors who would like to speak at graduation must complete the application by May 1st. Contact Ms. Welch if you have any questions. Virtual trials will begin May 4th for the Auxiliary Dance Team. Contact Alyssa Schultz if you have any questions. Given the school closure and social distancing mandate, gatherings in the school parking lots or school grounds are not welcomed. Please stay home. That's all we have for announcements. Now to Josh Fano if this rain will continue after this quick commercial break. Good afternoon to you. You may have been dodging some off and on light rain showers throughout the day today. And we've got one more round of rain to get through. By 6 o'clock this evening, you can see a light band of showers near the Kansas Turnpike. But once that shifts out, we are done with the rain for today. And we'll be staying dry through tonight as well. Of course, no thunderstorms around here today. But down to our south, across portions of northeast Texas, into southeastern Oklahoma, and to the east, there's an enhanced risk for severe weather. And that's just kind of a reminder that we are in severe weather season. And even though we haven't seen a huge outbreak around here yet, the potential is there for any of these storm systems to produce severe weather. So make sure you're staying weather aware over the next couple of months. As we take a look at your forecast for tomorrow, though, no severe weather. It's going to be a beautiful day. Morning lows in the low 50s, a very mild start. Mid 60s by noon with clearing skies and how does sunny and 75 degrees sound by tomorrow afternoon and evening. It's going to be almost a treat repeat as what we had yesterday. So just a great day coming up on Thursday. Now our next weather maker does arrive late Thursday night into Friday morning. This is by 4 o'clock. There might be some scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms across southeastern Kansas, but really we're not thinking a whole lot with this. Maybe a slightly better chance later in the day by noon. You can see a little bit more widespread activity, but we're not thinking that everyone's going to see the rain. It's just at least that our next chance of rain coming in Thursday night into Friday morning. There it is on the SVTV 7-day forecast. Temperature-wise, we're going to stay pretty steady in the upper 60s to low 70s for highs through the weekend. But check out what happens early next week. That is a big surge of warm temperatures. We're talking highs in the upper 70s and maybe even touching 80 degrees by next Tuesday. In the longer range, it looks like those above average temperatures will continue. And in terms of precipitation, we could dip below average. This carries through us through about the first week of May. So that is your latest weather forecast. Kylie, back to you. Thanks, Josh. That's all we have for today, Vikes. Have a great rest of your day. Mm -hmm.